All eyes were on the Parc de Prince on Sunday as leaders Paris Saint-Germain took on Marseille in part one of a classic double header between the two rivals. They'll meet here again in the French Cup quarterfinals on Wednesday. Nine days before their all-important Champions League clash with Real Madrid, PSG were looking to extend their unbeaten run against Marseille to 16 games in all competitions. A 14th straight home win in the league would also put them 14 points clear of champions Monaco at the top. Well, Marseille came desperately close to beating Paris in the reverse fixture, only to be denied by a superb Edinson Cavani free kick at the death. Three days after reaching the Europa League last 16 at the expense of Braga, Rudy Garcia's side were determined to extend their eight-game unbeaten streak in the league. But it was Paris who forged ahead in just the tenth minute of the game, Kylian Mbappe making the most of a mistake there from Jordan Amavi and firing in his tenth league goal of the season. He becomes the youngest ever goal scorer in the Classic at 19 years and 67 days. And a perfect start for Paris, who doubled their lead before the half hour. An 8 one 2 here between Adrian Rabio and Levin Kazawa. Rabio's cross for Neymar and turned into his own net by the unfortunate Rolando. Clinical stuff this from Paris, taking a 2 0 lead with just a single shot on target at this point. Well, Marseille coach Rudy Garcia made a tactical switch before half time. Morgan Sanson replacing Lucas Acampos. And the visitors did finish the first half strongly, but they never really tested Alphonse Ariola. Dimitri Payet here firing over the bar. So Paris leading at 2 0 at half time. And the Capital Club haven't lost to Marseille since way back in November 2011 on course to make it 13 wins in their last 16 meetings. Now the writing was on the wall for the visitors when Paris made it 3-0 on 56 minutes. Great work here from Neymar down the left flank and Edinson Cavani took care of the rest. Ligue 1 Conferama's leading scorer with his 24th goal of the campaign. El Matador getting away from Rolando there. Decidedly, it wasn't the Portuguese defender's night. But it wasn't all good news for PSG as Neymar twisted his ankle 10 minutes from time. Nasty looking injury this for the Brazilian. You can see it here on the replay. Just watch his right foot there. The world's most expensive player had to be stretched off. And he could well miss the big game with Real on March the 6th. Although coach Yone Emery said after the game that he preferred to stay optimistic. Having made their three subs, PSG were down to 10 men for the final 10 minutes, but they held on to their clean sheet. Thiago Silva getting across there to deny Clinton and G. Ariola then getting his fingertips to that cross from Florian Tova. Luis Gustavo trying his luck on the follow-up. Comfortably gathered though by the home keeper. As it finished 3-0, PSG are now unbeaten in 50 games at the Parc des Princes since a 2-0 loss to Monaco back in March of 2016. And they're cruising towards a seventh Ligue 1 Conferama title. Now 14 points clear of Monaco at the top.